All right, so we have Delta Force Hawk Ops official zero damn map gameplay trailers. I got to the video. Let's go, man. No, no, man. I had high expectations for this game. The Delta Force Hawk Ops. Uh, game, uh, game footage is not final graphics. In, uh, okay, da, 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 okay. Now, this could be potentially good. We just need them to. Is that an alligator? Ooh, ooh. Did he just flip that alligator over? He just made the alligator do a 360. Watch out here. Okay. This could be something. Let's hope. Let's hope it is. What type of what type of guy was was that a juggernaut? What was that? And he came around the corner. He said, "Hey, hey, hey!" Y'all heard him? Ooh, hold up! The aiming is not bad in this game. Ooh, 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 ooh! Oh, hold on! They're about to rob the bank in here. Okay. Was that a slide cancel? Okay. You know what? The weapon selection is not bad. The weapon selection is not bad at all. Okay then. First of all, that was a good trailer. That was a really good trailer. Number one, here's what I want to say, right? I like the weapon selection. I like that a lot of these weapons we've le we've either like recognized in like other Call of Duty games or like you know if you guys are really like that with weapons in real life, then you're you know you'll recommend like you know because listen that's scary. Let's just before we you know I get into the trailer, you know you know what's so crazy? Like bro, I remember um, <laughs> I remember I saw this gun right. I'm like oh snap! I think I've seen that gun in Call of Duty. One dude, he was like, oh, yeah, you know, all, all the Call of Duty guns. Yeah, I got the MP5, the the MP15713. Yeah, I got that. Yeah, man, it can, it can hit something from a mile away. I'm like, I'm like, oh, oh, okay. And I had to, I, bro, I had to step away from that man, bro. That's a cold black school threat right there, bro. Bro, and listen, if you have somebody ever try to describe a gun's name, and they, and they name, like, all the numbers in it, bro, they're school threats. Just stay away from them. Other than that, listen, here's what I say about this. Graphically, it looks nice. Graphic-wise... You, you you did good, right? I would say that one thing that probably needs to be worked on is, I mean, I was about to say the aiming. See, the aiming, it looks a little bit funny because on, on some, like, clips, whatever, bro, it's like you, it's like, I wouldn't say, like, aim by. I'm not saying that, and like, a bad thing. I'm saying aim by is, like, a good thing. Like, the aiming looks, like, really good. Or I don't know if they, like, switch, like, guys, like, you know, trying to, like, play the game or whatever. I don't know if they switch, you know, the people playing or whatever, but... For one clip, the guy hit two people like boom, boom. Let me see if I can uh, go back to that clip right there. Whenever he walked in here, whenever uh, he opened like the, I forgot what part it was, but whenever like he opened like the like the little bank thing, whatever, and it was two guys, he boom, boom, like it was direct. But then there was some other clips to where like you know you're shooting somebody and the aim was like kind of uh, off because of like the gun's recoil and stuff like that. So. I mean, obviously, you know, that's not really the aimer's fault if the recoil is ridiculous. But, um, obviously, it, it, it looks good. Um, okay, I, that was a clip right there. So, right here. Boom, boom. Now, I don't know if that was, like, PC, mouse and keyboard, or I don't know if that was, like, but that was hard. That was really hard. Um, I don't know. This game, see, games like this, bro, to where they could potentially be something... I'm hoping that it. I'm hoping that it is something. But at the end of the day, I don't know, bro. I don't know. I. I, I don't. I don't. I'm confused because it looks good. I mean, the, the missions seem like action packed and fun and stuff like that. But at the same time, you know, if we get the game, you know, will the graphics look a little, you know, look a little iffy? You know, will the aiming be a little bit of iffy? Like we don't know. But 
so far, bro, it looks good, bro. So far, it looks good. They're showing us gameplay, and the gameplay looks fire, bro. The gameplay does look fire. Uh, something like these, like, um, I mean, I imagine, like, you get, you get the options, like, aim in sight, whatever. But some of these, like, hit fire guns, whatever, um, they looked okay. Um, I don't know if, if some of those weapons are only hit fire, and, like, that's how you're supposed to shoot them or whatever. But, I mean... I mean, that's not really necessarily a problem. I just thought I'd just point that out because there was a lot of footage in here to where, like, a, they shot, like, a lot of these guns from, like, hip fire and stuff like that, which, again, isn't a problem. But, you know, I just hope that we get the option to, like, aim in and stuff like that. But other than that, I really got no problems with this, to be honest. I really I really don't have no problems with this. It looks good. Um, and, and, yeah, man, uh, bro, first of all, okay, and, and let's talk about this alligator. I'm, I'm so glad I clicked on the alligator. Bro, the fact that an alligator can, bro, can... Uh, creep up on y'all, bro, and then like that bite and stuff like that. I didn't even know that you can like interact with like alligators and, and other animals and stuff like that. So if they're gonna have alligators in here, then I recommend not. I well, I don't really recommend, but uh, I can see like them having like dogs and stuff. Like if, if that's like a because, bro, if they can have if they can like have like alligators, they can definitely have dogs and they got all types of juggernauts and stuff like that. So. Um, you know, it's not bad. I mean, he did. <laughs> he literally flipped the alligator in like a 360. So, like, that was crazy, man. Other than that, I really got nothing else to say. Um, so far, I mean, looking at the, like this, this, this scenery right here. I mean, it doesn't look bad, bro. The map design, it, the the maps definitely look more um, camp worthy. I feel like in this game, you can't really just go like out and about. Like, you kind of have to like be behind something uh peeking a little bit like you can't really be like a so like for example like like a like an escape from turkoff like that game you got to be careful you got to know where everybody's at what you you, you, you kind of have to like keep your head down you can't just walk out like call of duty you know so um at the end of the day it doesn't look bad i can see this game going somewhere we'll see if it actually comes out and stuff like that because you know we all know a lot of games have you know has, has looked good in the trailers and stuff like that and, but they never came out you know due to like you know money and stuff like that so hopefully the game comes out and uh get a thumbs up for me man honestly get a thumbs up for me we'll see we'll see we'll see how it goes first of all i love this detail right here y'all see this detail right here y'all see like the like the reflection of like of like the water on the floor that's re that's hard that's hard okay that's hey We'll see. We'll see if it if it actually comes out. We'll see if it's good or whatever. But Delta Force Hawk Ops, y'all did a good job. Other than that, comment down below. What do you guys think about it? See you guys later for the next one. I'm out and.